right, in question B3, it tells you to factor each expression by factoring out the greatest common factor. Now, this hint right here won't be on your quiz tomorrow. I'm just going to tell you to factor. You should always be thinking, does the problem have a greatest common factor? This one does not. 1, negative 12, and negative 28. Even, even, odd. This is an odd number. This is an odd number. There's very likely a number. I don't know it, so I'm going to use... Um, you can use your calculator. I'll show you what I do. You can actually put into your tables 105 divided by x. And then I can look for all the numbers that are not uh, decimals, and it'll actually tell me all the whole numbers. So 21 times 5, uh, 15 and 7. Uh, 7 times 15 is the same thing, 5 and 21, 3 and 35. And then I can do the same thing for uh, 147, 3 and 49, 1 and 47, um, 21 and 7. Now, as I list out all the factors... Get one more and just to demonstrate this. 21 and 7, which we already had. That's probably it. What does that mean? That means that 105 is 21 times 5 times x times x times x. And negative 147 is negative, I'm going to choose negative 7. Negative 7 times 21 times x. Plus, what do they have in common? 21 and 1x. Now, all I have to do is simply write the numbers that are not circled in red. 5x squared minus 7. You'll notice this one, you're missing a b value. And so that's 5x squared plus 0x minus 7. But if I do the x method for this, that would be negative 35 and b value 0. Are there two numbers that multiply to be 35 and add be 0? No. Now, here's another hint. When you have a 0 here, these have to be the same numbers, but one has to be positive and one has to be negative, right? Because they have to add to be 0. So like a positive 5 and a negative 5, that's 0. But it doesn't multiply to be that number. What does that mean? In blue, this is prime. 5x squared minus 7 means you can't factor it anymore. Now, don't make the mistake of writing prime as your answer, because it's telling you to factor it, and this is my answer. 21x times 5x squared minus 7 is our answer.